Canton Lake is a favorite for serious anglers because of the variety of fish you can catch here, especially the sometimes elusive walleye. They're uh, tricky fish to catch. Mark Munkress has fished here at Canton Lake since he was a kid. Walleye are kind of finicky. Uh, they tend to want to bite late in the evening, so sometimes the guy's got to fish at night. And... So for him, he's not that picky about his catch. Yeah, there are a lot of fishes, channel cat, crappie, walleye, sand bass, uh, blue cat, whatever is biting. I like to fish anything. The lake stays stocked with fish thanks to the Oklahoma Department of Wildlife Conservation. They took us out for a day on the lake to show us how they do it. Canton Lake is definitely known for their walleye population. The walleye population is large because Canton Lake is a spawning lake meaning the wildlife department takes the fish out to reproduce and later stocks the lake with even more fish. The anglers of Oklahoma benefit the most. But today we are headed to the mouth of the North Canadian River to collect white bass males. Usually it's the end of March, first of April, the water temperatures will get about 55 to 60 degrees and the white bass will run up these rivers to spawn. So the crew will travel up and down the river to collect as many fish as they can to later fertilize eggs from the striped females to create a hybrid striped bass. Hybrid striped bass are really sought out fish. They're, they grow fast, they're, they're aggressive, and our anglers just love to catch them. Last year the lake was stocked with 41,000 hybrid striped bass. They're a bigger fish than the white bass and uh, they're more aggressive than the striper and they're just a good fish to catch and they're, they're good to eat. And according to these experts, the best time to catch the hybrid striped bass is in the summer with live bait. Discovering Oklahoma at Canton Lake, I'm Deanne Stein.